All right, guys, this is what some of y'all have been waiting for to see the new Haro Vintage Super Pro 48s in person. Some of you may have already gotten yours or are waiting to get them. Uh, this is a quick up close so you can take a peek at these wheels, see what's going on with them. This is the front. Um, I'm not going to go too in depth, just allow everybody to get a a good visual there is no ridge there it's just got a shape not like the original uh, peregrines just kind of give you an idea of what these wheels look up like some of us may never see them up close or get an opportunity to get a good in-depth look uh, I'm also going to go over some of the imperfections uh that you know are on these wheels that you know what who cares whatever they are what they are um so first off these these are the fronts um one thing you'll notice is that if you're gonna run pegs uh, these are really not going to be long enough to get a lot of meat on there the other thing is uh, for those of you who are going to be putting these on the older Haros, these uh, 3 8 axles are not slotted to fit. So be aware. Uh, the other thing is right here where the pinned joint is on this particular wheel, there is some issues with the chrome. It's already pitted, brand new, just got these wheels yesterday. So you are, may have that issue. Uh, also, on the hubs, these are not stickers. I guess uh, what John Bolgen says, these are water transfers. So, you know, they're delicate. They're going to have marks. Um, this one has some marks right there. And marks right there. And I have four pair, two pair which I've received, two pair which I'm still waiting on. And so far, all four of the wheels in the two pair that I have have similar imperfections and markings. They are double wall. So that's that. Here's the rear. Nice chrome overall, you know. Again, you'll see just small little nicks and imperfections, and some are going to be worse than others. Some are going to be banged up pretty good. This one has uh, some stuff right there, you know. You're going to see a lot of smudges on these wheels also. Uh, the other thing... every single one of these wheels at the pinned joint and most of you are going to be smarter than I am about these wheels I'm not a uh, you know not a super knowledgeable person about these old wheels but little issues right there at that joint you know where the chrome might might give you some problems but you know who cares some of you are going to be taking these wheels and putting them on bikes uh, to put them away or to show them or whatever the deal is. Well, that's not where any of these wheels are going to go. I've got four pair and all four pair are going to get ridden. They're going to get stood on. Uh, three pair are going on to the 86 Haro uh, frame and fork kits that Haro put out a while back. As a matter of fact, one of them might be going on on this one, which is my built bike and I'll talk more about that bike some other time but there you go the new Haro vintage super pro 48s and that's what you might be getting